Oh, yeah, yeah, it does. Give it up for Austin Savai! Give it up one more time for all the comics coming out here. Give it up for the singers, too. Uh, I've got a question for all the, the parents in the house here. Don't you all hate when people claim to be like a dog mom or a dog dad or some shit? Shit's the worst. I, I don't have kids, but it's completely different. You can't compare the two, right? If you don't believe me, just try out this little trick. Let your dog outside in your front yard to take a shit. See how people respond. And then let your kid go out there and do the same thing. I, I don't think the reaction will be the same, you know? That's all I'm saying, man. Uh, I'm trying to get into the dating world. It's tough. Cause I'm awkward. You know, that shit, you couldn't tell. And they say a sense of humor is very important in a relationship. And uh, people think because I do comedy, like that I have a leg up in that, but I don't. Because I'm very sarcastic. And when women don't understand I'm being sarcastic, I just come off like an asshole. You know? Dating me is kind of like getting a golden shower. Exciting at first, but the, she'll always leave disgusted after. <laughs> no, but uh, I do believe wholeheartedly that we have to have a similar sense of humor if we're going to date. If we can't laugh together, we can't be together. Like, it's that simple. Dating someone with a different sense of humor is kind of like a Kardashian dating a basketball player, you know? It's just going to crash and burn. Uh, I don't know if you guys believe in God or not. Uh, I believe in God because uh, there's a thing called whiskey dick. And uh, most guys think that that's a, a curse, but I definitely think it's a blessing because I think whiskey dick has saved us from a lot of mistakes. <laughs> but uh, if there is a God, I... I think God hates women. Uh, hear me out here. <laughs> Just, it's a rough start, but uh, why did God make it so hard to please a woman in the bedroom, right? Finding the G-spot shouldn't be like finding Osama bin Laden. You know? <laughs> yeah, I, I know I'm fucked up. I'm up here telling jokes, vying for your guys' attention. Uh, I have siblings. I'm um, the third, and I'm the last, hopefully. Uh, <laughs> They say success comes after your greatest failure, so I just think my parents should try for one more. No. Uh, I had a very interesting conversation with my uh, sister the other day. Uh, she came out as bi to me, and I was like the first person she ever told, and that's supposed to be like a big special moment. But I'm the worst person to tell that to, because I'm very nonchalant about things, and I feel like if you're pouring your heart out like that to somebody, you know, you should be more supportive. I had the weirdest response, too. She's like, Austin, I think I like girls, too. And I was like, yeah, you get it, you know? We're both on the same page here. Dicks are gross, you know? <laughs> I've been on the dating apps, I'm on Tinder. I don't know why. Tinder is awful, ain't it? I don't
don't get why girls are posting pictures of their dog on Tinder. I think that's a little passive. If you want to fuck on all fours, you know. <laughs> all right, guys, uh, that's my time. If you want to see more of me, uh, I'll be at a roast battle uh, this Friday night. So, you know. Hi everybody, give it up, give it up! Yeah. Is this your pen?